The Garden Web women's basketball team closed out its non-conference slate on Saturday afternoon with an impressive 82-59 win over the Converse Valkyries coach. You have to be happy with your team. You head into conference play, winners of eight straight. Well, I'm really pleased with the basketball team. You know, we today we got kind of uh, a little bit sloppy at times, but at times we look really good too. So, uh, very pleased. You know, if you told me at the end of the non-conference, take 10 and two, I take that losing to Central Florida and Kentucky, two pretty good teams. You know, you and I have done a number of interviews together, and it seems like the the common denominator here is that it seems like. It can be somebody different every game leading the way. Alexis Hill was your leading scorer in a Western Carolina win. She's number two on the team with 13 points today. And then you get Tierra Huntsman, who ties her career high with 26. Well, that's the kind of team we got, kind of offense we got. You know, there's been times Celia Tibbs has had great games, Morgan Pointer, uh, Alexis Huey had a great game, uh, Nia Lee. You know, we've had Savannah, Carly. Kai, you know, about all of our players that have had come in and had really good games at different times. And that's what it's all about. You know, for us to win uh, the conference championship, where we're going to have to play maybe three games in three days, you got to have uh, nine or ten kids who can really step up and help you. Coach, we're going to talk with uh, Corinna Vigan here in just a minute. Uh, how about some uh, notes on her? Corinna, we got, uh, she hasn't been playing basketball very long. We redshirted her last year, and I really think Corinna's going to have a great career for us. This is a real learning experience for her this year, and I think next year she's going to step up when Celia graduates and play some you know, good minutes. We'll have Morgan Pointer, a solid player, back, and Corinna. We're really excited about our future. Coach, we look forward to seeing you. You're going to open conference play Tuesday night at uh, High Point, but we'll see you next Saturday here against Radford. Thanks, Fabian. All right, that's the head coach of the running Bulldogs, Rick Reeves. And now let's bring in the young lady from Germany, in Corinna Weigand, and I didn't have an opportunity to get a step stool here, so I'll try to get up on my tiptoes. But you play a season high 19 minutes today. Tell us about getting that much needed experience. Yeah, it was um, new for me to play so much, and I really liked it to get the experience, especially in this game. Yeah. And um, yeah, I, I hope um, to, to see more. Yeah. And, of course, you're getting ready for, for next year. But it was a good win today because I think everybody that Gardner Webb had dressed out was able to play. Yes, I, I think it was really good that everyone has the chance to get um, playing minutes. And I think everyone did a good job. So it was a good team um, win. Corinna will get you, let you get in the locker room with the rest of the team. Thank you. All right, Corinna Weigand, one of our guests here as we discuss Saturday's big win for the Garden Web women's basketball program. Again, 82-59, the final over Converse at Paul Porter Arena.